Hey everyone, okay, so this is part two, or is it part one, or is it part three? It really depends on how we upload. So, I'm gonna be going through the glowing foundations. Now, I mentioned three in my previous video on the trends, so let's talk about this one. There is, I've never felt a texture like this foundation before. I'm gonna be applying it on very, very, on normally, uh, oh, let me start again. I'm gonna be applying it on my skin without any moisturizer on, so you can really see what it goes on like, or primer, nothing like that, just straight onto bare skin. Now this is by Natasha Denona, I believe it's called, and it's the Face Glow Foundation SPF 15. Now I'm gonna be using shade 40, and I hope it's gonna be quite a good match. Now the thing with this is, with a lot of dewy foundations, when you apply them to the skin, they not only look dewy, they feel dewy as well. You like that, and you're like, oh my God. So this has none of that. So I'm gonna pump out one pump of this. This is light to medium buildable coverage. So I'm gonna take my number 13 brush. And I'm just gonna put a little couple of stripes onto my face and I'm gonna buff this in. Now this has a really, really strange texture that it kind of is, when you move it, it feels like it's kind of hard to move. There's a real stick to it, which I've never experienced before because most Dewey Foundation go on really dewy and sort of slip around and all of that stuff. This absolutely does not do that. It feels completely different on the skin to any other dewy foundation I've tried. It has a really, really, now, even though this says glow, I actually think that's quite a good name for it. I think that the skin glows. There is no visible um, shimmer in this at all. Now I'm gonna use a tiny, tiny bit of concealer and I'm just gonna apply this just underneath my eyes, just to brighten things up. And I'm just gonna use my ring finger to kind of press it in. Now Natasha has a whole range, a whole system of the Glow products, but to try and complete the look and give you a little bit more sort of clarity, I'm gonna apply a bit of cream blusher and bronzer just around the outside perimeter. So I'm just gonna use an hourglass um, bronzer and I'm just gonna apply this with my fingers just on the outside. Gonna buff that in and a tiny bit onto the cheekbone area. And now I'm just gonna take a little bit of cream blusher and apply this to the cheekbones. And last but not least, this tiny, tiny touch of powder just down the T-zone area and we'll leave the rest of the face completely as is. Okay, and that's the completed look. Now, I think it looks really, really nice. No shimmer on the face, there is no highlighter. This is the finished look and this is filmed in a very high definition so you can really kind of see it, but it really gives this kind of really healthy, sort of look to the skin and the feel of it, like I said, the texture of it is incredibly unique. Never experienced a foundation like it that has that kind of pull to it when it's a dewy foundation because most are like oil slicks. This is absolutely not. It is so beautiful to wear and really, really long wearing. There you go. Let me know what your thoughts are. Rate, comment, subscribe, all down there. Don't forget to share and I will see you all soon. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.